Hey guys, welcome to the video. I'm Van, and today we are testing the Wim Hof breathing technique to see if his claim of being able to double your push ups is really true. We are going to do push ups more than you ever did without even breathing. We've never tried his method before. We are just curious to see if it actually works. Okay, so this is going to go as follows. I found a video where he goes about the whole process of how to breathe and that is what I'm going to be following. We both tested our max push-ups like a couple of weeks ago. For me, it was 25 and for her it was, it was 40. So let's see if the Wim Hof method really holds up. I wanna blow your mind. Are you ready? Here we go. Pull it in, let go. Pull it in. lightheaded and dizzy. It kind of worked, but not as well as he claims. I didn't get double my push-ups, but I did get 31, so six more than my maximum. Now it's her turn. Let's see. I think that the more push-ups you are able to do, the obviously trickier it gets to get that number even higher because you are spending a lot of time without breathing at all. So we'll see. 40. Yeah, we'll see if she can up that a little bit. Are you ready? Here we go. Pull it in, let go. Pull it in, let go. Rest, feel the... Pull it in, let it go. Let your mind go with it, go with it. Whenever you take the last breath, pull it in, let it go. Up and back. Well, that was our first try of the Wim Hof breathing technique. She ended up getting two more reps with a couple of reps in the tank left because she was desperate for some air. I ended up getting six more, which is quite good to be fair. But I think the claim of doubling your push ups is somewhat of an overstatement. However, it was really, really fun. I definitely encourage you to try it if you're curious. I would say though, having never done the Wim Hof method before, that what happens is that you get a huge spike in adrenaline, which is what allows you to do a lot of push-ups in a really small amount of time. So at first you're like pushing really quickly, but then it gets to a point where you get to maybe around your max push-ups and you start needing some air and it gets kind of tough, especially to keep doing the push-ups without breathing. But yeah, I think it's a fun little experiment. We will definitely be looking more into his breathing technique. <laughs> well, anyways, um, that was it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If so, give me a like and see you in the next one.